A federal lawmaker has promised to push for legislation that will ensure quality education in his constituency. Abdul Razak Namdas represented Mayo, Belwa, Jada, Gandhi and Tongo local government areas of Adamawa State says part of the plan is to ensure the safety of students. Students in Nigerian boarding schools, especially in the northern parts, have become more security conscious than their counterparts in other parts of the world. This is due to the increasing cases of kidnappings of students. More than 700 students have been kidnapped in schools since December. And in spite of this, this school in Adamawa State has no security operative, a situation that is worrying to a member of the House of Representatives, Abdul Razak Namdas. The truth is that we should give education a priority. We, once we educate our children, the future will be bright for us. And uh, the only thing we can do to make them viable, to make them uh, the focus, is to contribute to the success of their education. And you need to have good classes for a learning environment that can make the children concentrate. Namdas says the National Assembly is doing its best to ensure security personnel are deployed to all boarding and day schools. But security isn't the only thing on the minds of members of the communities here. They also want more schools. I feel so happy. I feel very, very happy. I'm grateful about these uh, buildings Be because my community, my people will benefit from this school a lot. That was a school here, but it cannot be identified as a school. But now we feel as we are part of the government and we are very happy to see that. We are lack of many things in our school. We are lack of light. We are not going for night prep. And we are lack of cold. We are writing our works in classes where it's supposed to in hold. We are lacking of holes and lab. We don't have lab in our school. We are begging for, for the honor of to buy generator for us. The local governments that make up Namda's constituency are hopeful of seeing changes, not only with the security of their schools, but also in the number of the schools and the quality of education. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.